everybody. My name is Steve Barrio. I'm the VP of Field Engineering and IoT here at Canonical. And today I would like to discuss with you uh, Ubuntu Core. So first question that people ask me, what is Ubuntu Core? Well, that's our version of embedded Linux. It has been entirely fought for a few things, reliability and also security. What do I mean by that? Well, it was entirely repackaged around a container that we call Snaps. And the reason why we did this, well, first of all, if you want to guarantee security, security evolves through time. Ubuntu Core is designed to be in the field, so away from a data center most of the time, right? So what it means is that we do need to have a right way to deliver these patches to OSs that are like literally traveling the world. They could be at the top of a Swiss mountain, they could be on the water, they could be in a plane, you know, you name it. So the way we do this is that we are able to deliver that over the air. So that's what we call OTA. So by default, this machine that is running Ubuntu Core will call a few times a day back home. So either a proxy or your brand store and say, do you have updates for me? And if the answer is yes, it's going to download only the diff that is required in order to bring itself up uh, to the latest version. Now, as you may understand, these are devices, right? They are far away from immediate help. Well, guess what? If somebody made a mistake and that update actually fails, that would not be a good thing. Except that this machine also has uh, rollback capabilities. So it will try to install the latest version of the snap, but just in case it cannot, it will automatically roll back to what it was before. So you don't end up with an expensive paperweight. So security, reliability is extremely paramount to what we do. Now for security, another thing that we can enable is uh, secure boot. So immediately when we turn on the power, it's going to verify whether the image it's about to load is properly signed. Again, to prevent any tampering that you may not want to have happen in the field. I'm speaking, speaking, speaking. Frankly, I think that an image is worth 10,000 words. So let's take a look at what it looks like. So right now, I have this machine running on this uh, display. So it's a Ubuntu Core. It's actually Core 22. And one of, the, one of the things that I provided there is a list of Ubuntu security notices that actually could affect that machine, right? Now, our claim to fame at Canonical is that we provide up to 10 years of security patches. So you see, like, it's significant. There's a few hundred of these in each of these categories. But the nice thing about it is that almost all of them are fixed, especially for the critical and the highs. So that's cool. Uh, so that system should be safe. Uh, some of the snaps and packages, like I think on this one, there's about uh, 15 snaps. Only some of them are being displayed. It's pretty easy to install. You just need to say snap install, the, the name of the snap, and then that will be it. And then it's installing. We do also have other demos on the same demo station. So if I'm standing there, you can see that it's trying to detect my face, not actually detecting your face. So thank you very much for your help. And I also have another small demo about sensors, because let's face it, embedded software is all about sensors and actuators. And this is the uh, sensor that I have in my hand. It's connected to that machine through Bluetooth. And it measures a few things in the environment, like temperature, humidity, and so on. So for example, if I do this, you'll see that the humidity is skyrocketing, which you would expect. Those are only two examples of everything that we do. I shown you a few examples in AI and sensors, actuators, but in fact, we're also doing microcades, matter, thread. We help clients in industrial systems, in automotive. Uh, we have one client in particular, they are doing holograms. I mean, how cool is that? And of course, we also have real time. So it's a great day to be at Canonical, actually. There's a lot of cool stuff that's going on.